Hi, Cubs. It's Miss Candleberry, and I am here to, to to explain our work for today, Friday. I do believe this is day forty four zero of teleschool. Um, now, I just want to go ahead and say, if you haven't done the stuff in this second column on the right, this column, well, this column that says must do, please do it. It's, I'm not talking about the meetings, obviously. I'm talking about the end of the year tasks because that's what's going to make the end of the year really special for a lot for us. Um, since we can't be together to share, to, to celebrate it, I was, I'm really hoping that you guys all fill out these forms and, um, like make, re record the video. Like yesterday was recording an end of the year video. Um, on Monday it was taking, like dressing up in some of your favorite clothes and taking a picture in front of a blank wall, like from your top to your toes, so I can make a class picture. So please, 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 if you haven't done that, please do so, so that I can actually make the class photo. I would really like that. But it'll be kind of a bummer if we have like 12 kids and then we're missing the other 10. Um, so please do that if you haven't, and please do it, you know, kind of soon, because how else will I be able to make it? I do have to have some time to do that. Um, but anyway, let's get to today's Friday's um, activities today. Um, so it's field day challenges. What up? So let's click here to find some of the field day challenges that you guys can do. Um, especially if you have like siblings, this is going to be so much fun. But even if not, maybe if you only have your parent here. Um, so this says field day. Get ready for some home competitions. Here are 15 activities put together by Open Phys Ed. Each one has a demo video to let you know how to play. You can choose to do any or all of these activity, these activities. And then it says take a video or a picture of you doing your favorite activity and post it to the Spirit Week Palace. So cool. So let's say there's a spoon race, a penguin race, a backboard banquet. I wonder what that is. Um race let's say what is back to our bank it's so oh back you board bank it Sorry, no, okay. Hi, everyone welcome to open national field day i'm open national trainer william potter and this is backboard bank it get ready you'll need five large sock balls oh, I got a that. laundry basket or <laughs> a bucket uh -huh. and a wall or flat surface perfect Get set. Roll up the socks to make sock balls. Uh, all my Place the basket balls, or bucket right. against the wall and mark a distance 5 to 10 feet from the basket. Mm -hmm. Go. This event is called Backboard Banquet. The object of the game is to score as many points as you can in one minute. You do that by tossing the sock balls off the wall and into the basket. You must use the wall as your backboard and bank it into the basket. Oh, score okay. a point for every sock that is banked into the basket. Write your score down on the official field day scorecard. Uh -huh. It says as many points as you can, so I guess that after you get done, you run and get them and you keep doing it if you can. If you can. Very cool. You gotta use the backboard. I like it. So, hmm, that's probably the one that Miss Kennedy will do. I like that one. Wash your hands, Relay. I'm kind of interested in that too. Um, so basically you could do as many as you want. Uh, it's field day. Of course you want to do them all. Or at least if we were together, you definitely want to do them all. So why not? So enjoy this. Uh, make sure to post the information to the Padlet. I have really enjoyed like looking at the Padlet. Let me tell you. I know. Here, let's look really quickly this morning to see. When is it going to load? There's so many. It's can't load. Um, this morning to see all of the different um, examples. Now I'm going to go way down beyond all of this. Do, 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 do. Oh, if you didn't watch Ms. Bahar, Ms. Amato's video, it's great. All right. Um, let's see. It, there, in fact, Ms. Shouters is great. Like, this kid's is great. All these videos are great. Sorry. It's true. They're amazing. Um, there's Mason. There's his video. Uh, I'm just going to keep going down. Um, Nishvita has a video. Do, 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 do. This video is amazing, too. Some Things Never Change Frozen 2. Uh, amazing. And then we have um, some of the animations. Look, Shrey's animations actually move. That's pretty cool. 
Um, look at this. Oh my gosh. I love it. Oh, I didn't favor that. I got to go back and listen to this too. I, I did listen to that. And now I don't remember. Uh, very cool. Very cool. Very cool. Now, what's that? Oh, she's going to sing. Oh, she's going to sing Moana. Okay. I'm going to have to go back and see that. So anyway, um, cool. There's some uh, animations down. Oh, look, somebody put their uh, model on here. How could I favorite that? I do favorite it. Okay. Um, I love it. Dialy. Great. How do I favor? It won't let me favorite it. I'm going to re. You know what? I'm going to re. There it is. I'll have to look at the troll song. Ooh, that's amazing. I wonder who did that. They didn't put their name on it. Jesus, cool looking. Wow. Okay. Sarvanch. Got a lot of stuff going on. Um, first of all, I want to say second grade totally rocked this. We totally, totally. That's really cool. Um, we totally uh, did the be have done the best out of all the grades. So a high five to y'all. A funny car animation. <laughs> okay. You'll have to tell me. This is very um, surreal, Mason. Anyway, um, very cute. Look how many things that we had to look at. Anyway, you can put your video of you doing the specials activity for today, the PE challenge, one of the, or more than one PE challenge, here on the specials palette. It's fun to see them. Um, second grade teachers, no joke, are really checking this thing all the time because we're having a great time. I wonder if anybody's posted any more fifth grade responses. Oh, yeah. Look. Oh, oh I saw the one with Mr. Rard. Anyway, um, it seems like it's going to be a great spirit. Miss Canterbury got caught up in Padlet. Excuse me. I'm still really tired this morning. So, um, your optional activity is today is to or is just to reflect. So, just to write about. It says, write a letter to a first grader who will be in second grade next year. What advice will you give them? Ooh. Ooh. All right. And then your end of the year task today is vote on class superlatives. So when I click on this, it's like choose a different person for each superlative. You can choose yourself one time. So you can choose yourself one time. So if I go here, um, now, superlatives are things. Not everybody will get one of these, okay? So let's go ahead and say that. There's a chance that some kid might win, too. You never know. Um, we will have class rewards that, awards that Miss Candleberry gives us, but this is a little different. This is awards that you guys are going to give each other, just like fun little awards. And we're going to – it's not like they're getting a trophy or anything. I'm just going to – we're just going to reveal the winners on the last day um, next week. So you put your name here, and then you kind of choose. You choose like you drop down who's the best artist, who's the funniest, who's the kindest, who's the most fun to play with at recess, who's the hardest worker, who's the Lego master. Who's most fun to play a math or a board game with? Who always shares? So that one's good. Who's most scientific? Who has the best read aloud voice? Who's the person you want in your group? So like if you have anybody in your group, you want this person. Who knows just the most random stuff? Like they just know all kinds of random stuff. Um, and who's the most helpful? So there's only four, I mean, 13 things you're voting on. So just keep that in mind. Okay. So please do that. And if you haven't done the other activities, like I just said, if you haven't done the rest of these, please do them. They're very important. I know that it might not seem like they're that important, but we're not really going to be able to have like a normal end of the year. First of all, this one right here is so that you can be in this class picture that I'm going to put together. So please do that. Um, this one right here is about a form about yourself so you can be in the Kahoot. Next Wednesday, we're going to have a Kahoot only about our class. Only about our class. Every question is going to be, the answer is going to be a kid in this class. So I want to make sure that um, I have all the information that you think the other kids would know about you. Because I've done a lot of talking to you one-on-one, -on -one, so I might not, I might know something that maybe the other kids don't. So it's cool for you to let me know what you think that they know about you um, and what you don't mind me answer asking a question about um and then on wednesday all you had to do was nominate three people who weren't yourself to take home to adopt lloyd and then um make requests for our dance party 
Um, yesterday you were recording like a little really quick year in video just for the Cubs and for Miss Candleberry, kind of like a, a farewell so long kind of thing. You were posting it on Flipgrid, there are instructions here. So none of those activities on the right side sh would take you probably very long. So, and they're all very much centered about our class and centered on you. So they're not that like difficult. They're not like actually graded work. So please take some time to do that. Okay. All right, guys, if you have any questions about any of those activities or you need anything else, you can let me know in the comments or your parent can reach out on messages. Okay. All right, guys, have a great Friday. Maybe if Ms. Kittleberg can stop the video.